a girl, two girl groups just recently made a comeback. The first one is Wacky Mecky. So Wacky Mecky, they Ooh. actually had to postpone their comeback because their company was having some issues that just finally got resolved, it seemed like. So I'm very happy. And you haven't heard the song yet? Oh my gosh, you need to. It's really great. It's awesome. And I can't stop listening to it. When PD Nemes and I, we were just wandering around, like playing um, games earlier. I played it in the background <laughs> because um, Sancho PD Nemes was singing along with me. But to share this greatness with you, let's share the clip of their recent comeback song called La La La. Okay, guys, so you can kind of just get a short snippet of it. So that is Weki Meki's comeback song called La La La. And they just had M Countdown last night, I believe, right? So they just had the comeback stage. And the other groups I'm going to be mentioning, they just had their comeback stages as well. So do check them out. But this was Weki Meki. And honestly, even though a lot of people, like Saja Pini and I had this conversation where their concept is not very common for girl groups. So some of them are kind of hesitant on getting into Weki Meki or they think that they're not going to last that long in regard towards like for fame and fandom. You like should stand. Being a high they're yes. good. Stan. Yes. You know what Stan means? It means uh, just follow them. Support. Follow. Support. Yeah. Like and support. Everything. Because Weki Meki, two members have were previously in Produce 101. Yeah. And also, um, so one of them specifically, oh, there you go. So um, one member, you want to say? Your favorite? Your baby. Your baby. <laughs> Suracha. The tall one. The tall Dorian. one? Yeah. You're kind of the same height in this picture. But okay. the one in the red Here. hat. How about this one? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Dorian. They're I, actually really cute. They've been friends since like ele element of middle school. Mm -hmm. and then At a very young age. Yeah, really, really young. So, yeah, so these were the two cute. from Produce 101. And Sasha Pinini's baby, mm -hmm. the tall one, as she calls her <laughs> in the photo. You might have seen her face before if you used Maybelline oh New York. Because she does, well, <laughs> she, is. <laughs> she took up the whole screen. So she is a model for Maybelline New York. She is um, the model for them. So you might have seen her around in some commercials and some photo shoots because they do promote her for the makeup line. Right, and also my favorite that she that is also in the photo. She has been in quite a few programs such as Golden Tambourine, and she's a I don't know. She's been around for a lot of other reasons too. Like in a lot of fan cams, see you see her like messing around a lot. And of course, I really love her a lot more because she is a huge BTS fan as well. So you see her doing choreo um, dance covers for BTS, and when they add music programs, you see her like dancing around in the corner and singing along with them. So I thought that was really cute. And that get, got me into liking them because of mostly these two members. Because Roger Panini loves one of them and I love the other one too. But I'm taking the time to learn more about the members specifically because of this comeback. It's just so good and amazing. And I did have the clipping from their comeback stage, but oh, let's not bombard you so much. Let's go ahead and go on to the next group. But again, you guys, as Roger Panini says, stand, stand them, follow, like them. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, so let's go into the next girl group. You ready, PD Neem? CLC, Crystal Clear, as they're also well known as. So, they're from Cube Entertainment. They finally had a comeback stage, a comeback song, after a long wait because the other day I was asking PD I was like, where are they? <laughs> Honestly, they had their comeback song called Hoblin, but now they are back with Black Dress. And they came back with a lot, with a much more mature concept because. Hoblin is where they start becoming like bad girls, right? A more um, teenager image compared to the cute girl image, like school girl image that they had. So they broke out into more of like a gangster bad girl image, but now they are very high class mature ladies in black dress. And here is a quick clip of the MV that just released, released today. <laughs> Black Dress by CLC. What do you... 
Um, PD Names, did you actually get a chance to watch CLC's um, song yet? Not yet. Probably Not watch yet. Watch it tonight, yeah. Watch it tonight. Mm. So I think that compared to the other songs that they had before, this is a really good image for them because it's so much more different than what they had before. And I really do like it. And I really do look forward to seeing like what stage pressures they're going to be bringing because, again, this is something new than what they had before. And they did have a comeback stage at the same time just as um, the others did. So just last night, they do have a um, performance stage as well. Uh, I had the clip, but uh, you guys can watch it on your own time. It's really good. You should check it out. But one thing I was a little confused about is, you see the title, right? It's called Black Dress. So I was kind of hoping that they're going to wear a black dress in the music video, but they didn't. They wore a white dress instead. So I was a little confused, but... Um, you know, they did wear black outfits, so it does fit for their song. I need to read more in what the song means overall, but I really do like it, and I look forward to see what CLC will bring back for this comeback. Okay, so the last group I want to bring to you guys to talk about is NCT! Do you guys remember when I talked about them before? The 18-member group? Because they just got three three more new members. They officially had a comeback and the comeback song for right now is by NCTU because this is a subunit by um, SM Entertainment for NCT so it's not the members that are in that group are not official so they do switch out the members here and there but this is only the beginning for NCT's comeback because they are going to be having an album this year called NCT 2018 so they're going to be releasing out more songs more videos, so this is only one because supposedly they're going to be releasing six videos in total. So preparing for their comeback. So the first one that just came out is called Boss. And here is a quick clip of their music video, Boss For You. So, there's that quick clip for you. I really do like it, you guys. Compared to one of their other songs before, I really do like Boss. In the beginning, I didn't really know what to think because they, the whole line is saying, like, um, I am a boss, pretty much, right? It's repeatedly saying, I'm a boss. And I'm like, okay, I, I, I get it. I get you're a boss. And then it kind of um, remind me more of their song, Cherry Bomb. Because in Cherry Bomb, they constantly repeat, say, I'm the biggest hit, I'm the biggest hit on the stage. I was like, okay. <laughs> but, so this song, um, they do repeat, I am a boss, constantly. But the beats that continuously keep dropping throughout the song, and the choreography is insane. So I, I highly recommend you guys to watch it. And watching their comeback stage as well is just mind-blowing. Just as much as um, the performance in the music video. And they are wearing the photo the outfit that they're wearing in this photo. So it adds on to the atmosphere for the song and just how powerful it is. And just this morning, they released a teaser for the member 10. Literally, the number 10. So T-E-N. There is a teaser out for him right now because he is going to be having a duo with... Um, how do you say his name? Taeyong. Um, Tae Taeyong. Tae Tae yeah, so him and Taeyong are going to be having a duo. And... The song, as you guys can see, is called Baby Don't Stop. So there is a teaser photo out. I think there's a photo in there somewhere to show you. So that is one that is in the article. Oh, that's not there. Nope, that's Young. Keep clicking. Wait, what do you mean? Um, he's in there. The next photo. No, what do you mean? The photo for him. Ten. He's in there. That is ten. Nope, there's another photo. His other teaser photo. No, we have a, only have a teaser this video. One? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That one, that is one of the teaser photos, you guys. Look at that. Wait. Whoa. Man, Whoa. Cover, man, cover your eyes. I need to cover my eyes, too. But, you guys, that is one of the teaser photo. And they did release out um, a teaser video as well on their Twitter account. But if you go to their Instagram account, you know how people post out one picture by one to make a huge picture? So there is a huge picture one by one on NCT's Instagram account. But let's show you the teaser for Baby Don't Stop. Is it? Sorry. Mm -hmm. Stop. There you go. Baby Don't Stop. Stop. Baby Don't Stop. Stop. Baby Don't Stop. Stop. 
Okay guys, so what what do you think? From like that, um, I mean from the teaser photo you saw you're like omo. <laughs> I was like omo. When I saw when I when I was doing my research, I was like, oh my gosh, cover your eyes. And um I mean we a lot of um NCT fans are looking forward to see what um this comeback is going to be like this next song that they're gonna be releasing, right? Because there are six in total. Here is the second one that's dropping. So, we shall see what exactly this video is going to be. Um, when is it going to be released? And also, what is it going to be about? 